Well, it's New Year's Eve, uh, I've run to the Ponderosa on Horseshoe Pass up near Langothlin, um, underneath the M54 Junction 7 bridge, see who else turns up. So Neil turned up on his black glide at the M54 bridge and we set off towards Shrewsbury down the dual carriageway. Uh, of course, it started raining as we'd expected. Trog was waiting on one of the Shrewsbury bypass laybys, so we slowed a little and he caught up on his uh, Roking special. The rain was getting heavier, so we pulled in briefly at the Montford Bridge services, although the gate was shut. And while I was pulling on my waterproofs, um, the other Neil passed us on his bike. The A5 from Shrewsbury to Wasserford Street was, remained wet and we pulled into Mile End Services to catch up with Al, who probably wisely was in the car while his bike's off the road. After a quick look at Neil's and listen to Neil's 2000 Ultra Glide Classic, it was back on the A5 heading towards Langothlin.
The A5 route follows the 1820s Shrewsbury to Hollyhead Road, uh, laid out for stagecoaches. Uh, stagecoaches probably did about 10 miles an hour max. So why 200 years later the Welsh Government cut the speed limit for all vehicles going through towns and villages from 30 to 20? Um, I'm not sure, and I'm not convinced it's progress. I'm not sure the uh, 20 is plenty slogan is, is accurate. Anyway, we picked our way from Mile End Services uh, to Langothlan through the rain. Langothlan is a nice town that's well worth a visit uh, with a decent mix of shops and pubs. We have had a couple of rallies um, on the Langothlan Pavilion, which is just up the road and which will pass. However, we didn't stop and after crossing the River Dee and over the bridge and passing Langothlan Steam Railway, we headed up towards the Horseshoe Pass and uh, more rain. The Horseshoe Pass was a bit bleak as we got to the top, but it was good to pull into the uh, Ponderosa Cafe's car park. It's a popular bike stop um, during the summer with a lot more bikes up there usually. Uh, we parked next to uh, Dave's Pan Am. The views are pretty good, whether it's summer or winter, um, and so was the uh, cooked breakfast inside. But the food's good and reasonable reasonably priced um gavin's silver soft tail and tim's black breakout also in the car park uh, jason's fat bob was there as well somewhere but i missed it uh, apologies 
So overall, there was about 20 people from uh, Region 29 um, who made it up there by bike or car, which given it's New Year's Eve and the weather was pretty awful, I think is a reasonable turnout. Um, the four of us headed back through Langothlan, which, and by the time I got home, it was about a 110 mile round trip. So uh, a good way to spend uh, New Year's Eve's morning. Uh, cheers and see you on the next one.